The senator from South Carolina. Uh, thank you very much. Um, later this afternoon, I'll be introducing with Senator Scott, my colleague from South Carolina, Tim Scott, a statement uh, for the record honoring the life of Senator Hugh K. Leatherman, Sr. We just lost one of the most distinguished uh, members of the state Senate in the history of South Carolina. Senator Leatherman was a 40-year member of the South Carolina State Senate. He was the finance chairman, and his leadership is uh, legendary. With his help and assistance, uh, the Port of Charleston is on track to become one of the premier ports on the East Coast. He was indispensable in recruiting uh, Boeing, Honda, and Volvo to uh, South Carolina. He was a dear friend of both myself and Senator Scott. I've never known a more effective voice for South Carolina. <clears throat> he loved the PD, the Florence area where he represented, but when it came to helping South Carolina, Senator Leatherman was always there. You could count on him to lead from the front. Trying to solve problems was his life's work rather than creating problems. And I could just want to let the people of South Carolina know we've we lost a giant. There will be a big vacuum, and all of us in our state are going to have to up our game to replace the vacuum created by Senator Leatherman. Uh, his legacy is just extraordinary. He touched so many lives. He led the effort to put $300 million up front to deepen the Port of Charleston at a critical time. I could go on and on and on about how he helped every corner of the state from the mountains to the sea. He was a giant of the South Carolina Senate. His voice will be missed. He has a record of accomplishment that is just, uh, again, legendary. And to his family and legions of friends, we mourn uh, Senator Leatherman's loss, but you have a lot to be proud of. Now's the time to celebrate this great statement's li statesman's life. And Senator Leatherman truly was a statesman. He could work across the aisle, he knew how to get things done. He used the power given to him by his constituents and his fellow colleagues in the South Carolina Senate for the greater good. And there's no better legacy or no better statement about a politician than to say that he used his power for the greater good. Uh, the statement will be forthcoming for myself and Senator Scott and to his families and friends. We, we stand with you. You will not go through this journey alone. And to my many friends in South Carolina from the PD, you've lost a great champion, and I'll do everything I can to, to help fill that vacuum and void. Then I yield the floor.